Hello and welcome back to Yak Wax Lips. My name is Michael, your point and click adventurer, and this is episode 8 of Let's Play Broken Sword 5 The Serpent's Curse. In the previous episode, we're now in uh, in London, baby. And we're uh, we're at that Madovsky's ga uh, gaff. We're on the hunt for something to, I don't know, make sure that he's a bit of a crock. Madovsky had left the cabinet open. On the shelf inside was a business card and a scribbled note. I picked up the business card. It read, Wilfred Hobbs, Fine Art Restoration. I made a note of the address. Then I put the card back where I'd found it. No point arousing Madovsky's suspicions. What about the rest of it, though? Pick up the coin. See a penny, pick it up. Then all day you'll have good luck. That's going to bite me in the bum, isn't it? Let's just steal a penny. Let's put the card back, but we'll steal a penny. Hmm. A Russian Imperial egg. It looked rather plain. Can we open it? Hmm. No. It was a thank you note from a British politician. Huh. Madovsky certainly had some dubious friends. Oh dear. Everything was in Cyrillic, except for a number. 1869. 1869. Can we turn, turn the page? No, we can't. I suspected the medals weren't from the Moscow Debating Society. Anything else? No. The note read, L Serp drawings for you to check. WH. Now we're cooking with gas. Yeah. I wondered if the painting could be in the portfolio that Madovsky had taken. That's the Hobbs card, that's a note. It seems our Madovsky has friends in low places. Okay. It's like my oh. boss said. The guy wants to be a player. I want to have a look at this coin. It was the old coin from Madovsky's library. Okay. That was um, not very not very interesting. I thought he was going to say it was old or something. Ooh. Cigarette box. It was a beautifully inlaid cigarette box. Can we open it? The catch had snapped. Does that mean we can't open it? Oh, we could use the coin. Oh, please tell me this is the old coin to open the lock. By extraordinary good <laughs> fortune, the coin I'd picked up <laughs> was the perfect shape of course to it flip was. open the broken Fancy catch. that, Vanty Game. Fancy that. Oh, there's a key. Keys are always useful. Wonderful. Anything else? Romanovs. The same brand of cigarettes that were in the ashtray in Vera's security. Oh, this guy is shifty. I think we're probably done with this. Can you hear what they're saying? Yes. You should not have turned up here, Mr. Hobbs. I made it clear I would deliver the package later today. I wanted to make sure it got to me all right. I've got a lot of work to do on it. This is most inconvenient. Madovsky's arguing with his visitor, Ops, about the portfolio. That portfolio is important, I'm sure of it. Yeah, we're gonna to have to go and, and chase Hobbs. I wanna shut this box. Can we close the box? I feel like he's gonna walk in. We can't close the box. Um, do we need to hunt through this entire bookcase? I mean, let's just make a start, shall we? Leather-bound classics. Bought by the yard, no doubt. <laughs> Medovsky had an extensive collection of management books. Hey, who doesn't, The eh? Seven Secrets of Leadership, 2009. The Business Bonaparte, 1983. Office Eagle or Management Mouse, 1998. Okay, well, again, not interesting. I should have guessed. Keyboard was oh, Cyrillic. No. Um, is there... Is there, um... Numbers? There's no numbers, is there? Okay, I'm just going to click on something. Z, X... I needed a keyboard for reference. Okay. Maybe there's a book with a keyboard thing in it. I'm not going to hunt 
every single book here, but let's just see. Russian novels. Madovsky was clearly a big Tolstoy fan. I like Tolstoy as well. All right, let's talk to Nico. Nico, see if she has anything to say. Shh, I'm eavesdropping, Josh. She's eavesdropping. I ain't dropping no eaves. It was locked. It was locked. Maybe this key helps. Did that do anything? Oh, it, yes. The it study did. doors open now. Excellent. Is there anything else interesting? Hang on. Listen, Hobbs. Just take the portfolio and do your work. You are nervous, and I don't like that. Understood. I have got a few questions, though. I do not like questions, either. Hurry up. I noticed a couple of people arriving. Who were they? They look like coppers. They were from the insurance company. Has the... Oh, has the... Hobbs is going to head off with the portfolio. Whatever's in there is important. We need to stay with it. I got Hobbs' address from his card. When we're done here, we should check it out. Okay, Josh, but hurry. Madovsky will be back soon. Come on then. I'm feeling quite I'm gonna nervous. I'm going to check out the study. Okay. Oh god, there's loads to look at in here. Wow, there must be millions of dollars worth of art on these walls. These are glorious arts. Well done to the devs for making it so beautiful. The drawer was open. My heart skipped a beat. <laughs> but inside, I saw only a candy bar wrapper. Take it. Take it. No, he's not interested in the candy bar. Which is unusual for George, because he doesn't normally pick up a lot of crap. The desk was magnificent. Oh, this is a, yeah, this is a puzzle, isn't it? Oh, I pressed something. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here. Those two little holes were just waiting for me to put my fingers in. I resisted the urge. Eesh. What are these things? Fine, ashtray. Filthy habit. Anything else? Chair? The chair was fancy and probably more expensive than it looked. So we've got a fancy chair, fancy desk with lots of words, letters. Do we need to chop anything? Um, let's put... Let's put <laughs> that wouldn't work. Let's put the... Uh, no, he's, he's not interested. Trevor. Was it Trevor? Oh, there were scratches on them. Oh no, it's the same on there as well. Mm, no, we need to figure out what these letters say. I don't really want to have a look at all the all the pictures. Anything else? Can we just have a look at the chair by itself? It was an expensive chair. Seems to be very drawn towards that chair. Hmm. Maybe These I'll... paintings would have kept a critic enraptured for hours, but I didn't have time to dwell. You didn't, I oh. alright, okay. Um kind of feel like we need a book to reference that keyboard so that we can figure out what these letters are. Do we have anything in our inventory? No. I mean, we have Google. Can we not just Google it? Apparently not. What year was this made? Google was invented, wasn't it? It was like 2012? 13? 16? I don't know. Let me know when this, when this game was set. It was a Russian privatization voucher. I wondered why Madovsky displayed it so proudly. Madovsky in Libya. Happy days. What kind of guy hangs a picture of himself and Colonel Gaddafi on the wall? The kind who will commit murder in order to steal their own painting. Exactly, Nico, exactly. Uh, I don't want to go out the door yet. I need a reference for this typewriter. Um, let me, now I know what I'm looking for. Let me have a look at the bookcase again to see if it gives me any other dialogue options. 
Medovsky had an extensive... Yeah, nothing. And look at this side, and then I think I'll just slowly browse over. Leather-bound classics. No. Okay. So I'm just going to go like this. Doesn't seem like the type of ga game where it would have a hidden book in a bookcase. Like, um... What was it called? Is it... Not Fate of Atlantis. That's Crusade, I think, does that. I think you have to go... You have to know the specific book you're looking for. Yeah, no, this isn't... Nothing there. Hmm, okay. Maybe we, maybe we can have a look at this book again. Maybe there's something in here that I'm missing. Madovsky had left the cabinet open. On the shelf inside was a business card and a scribbled note. Yeah, we did, we did that. Everything was in Cyrillic, except for a number. 18... 1869. Maybe that's like a code for something? Can I... Everything was in... Turn it over? Eight... No, 1869. Hmm. Maybe there's something inside that egg. Can we use a paperclip with it? That wouldn't have... Can we open? It looks like you can open it. We've used the key. We've used the coin. Let's use the coin again. That would be point. Okay. Um. Uh, yeah, none, none of these are going to work. Nope. Stick the end I of need... matches in. No. The note read, El Sur... Yeah, we did that. We did that. Hmm. Okay, so we need to find some kind of cipher, don't we? See if Nico has any options. Nico? She's just going to tell me to go away. Shh. Okay. I'm eavesdropping, Josh. I ain't dropping no eaves. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I said that the first time. It's an automatic response. <laughs> if you know the reference, you know the reference. What else is in... Uh... Right, let's have a look at some of these paintings there. Nadovsky certainly loved art. Or pretended to. The painting reminded me of my Aunt Maud. I never liked her. That's not hung up very well, is it? Midovsky had a truly impressive collection of paintings. Midovsky had a truly... Midovsky had a truly... Okay. Midovsky had a truly... Thank you very much. Midovsky had a... Tr How about this one? Midovsky had a truly... Midovsky had a truly impressive collection of paintings. Okay, we get that. Open drawer. The drawer is open. Yeah, it's candy wrapper, isn't it? But in... Candy bar. Right. Let's have another look at this desk. I feel like... I'm going to use the coin with that, because it looks like that could fit in that there. That wouldn't have worked. No. Um... I'm just clicking this randomly. See what happens if I push all of them in. Nothing. Cigar cutter. What could I use the cigar cutter for? Those two little holes were just wood. I resist. There's nothing else on here, is there? Ashtray. Chair. Hmm. No, let's go back. Let's go into this door back again. Let's go back to the typewriter. And have a look to see if there's anything that I can do. I should do. have guessed. Keyboard was Cyrillic. Okay. I didn't know the symbols. If I'd been able to remember the layout of a US keyboard, I might have been able to figure it out. Can I? I tried to remember how that row of keys read on a U.S. keyboard. I thought George had like a photographic memory. A S D uh, G or F. <laughs> oh, I couldn't remember. Okay. Z X. I needed a keyboard for reference. Where can I get a keyboard for reference? I mean, it's on my. It's literally on my phone. Let's see if I can. Can I? No. Can I use my phone? I can't use my phone. Maybe I'll call my boss. I couldn't call Rickenbacker without a reason. I needed to see Madovsky's proof of ownership. Okay. Uh, 
Um, none of those, really. Surely I can just Google it. Let's go. I knew we should wait for Madovsky. Okay. Um, let's have another look at... What do I have in my inventory? Completion note, nail clippers, coin, shredded letter. I mean, it's... I, essentially, I need a reference, don't I? I need an English reference. Let's go back in here. Have a look around. Walk over here. Maybe the scene goes a little bit further. Hmm. I feel like this chair is quite important, but not right now, maybe. There's nothing else in here that can help me. And there's there's a hint thing here, isn't there? Hmm. What would happen if I click that hint? I feel dirty and wrong clicking that hint button. Mm, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it just yet. Let me go back in here. Right, what was the date on here? 1869, was it? Madovsky had left the cabinet yeah. open. On the shelf inside... 1869. So, if I... I'm, I'm, get, I'm just kind of guessing there here that I might type in 1869 on the typewriter. Maybe it's some kind of code. I should have guessed. Keep now, maybe... I'm guessing that these are letter, the numbers on the top, so... I didn't know oh. the symbols. If I'd been able to remember the layout of a U.S. keyboard... Right, can I use... That with that? Nope. I need to try something else. Uh, no, not the that coin. One. Not the coin. Maybe the phone? No. Um... Shredded letter. That was almost a great... <laughs> almost. <laughs> Where can I get an English? I figured that had to be the space. <laughs> well done. Um, let's look. Let's see if I've missed anything. Maybe I can look out the window myself. Some weird symbols here. No, I don't think this is going to help me in any capacity. Romanovs. Romanovs. That's the same name as uh, her from her from the Marvels, the Marvel films. The ashtray was full of cigarette butts. Romanovs. Romanovs. Natasha Romanov. Yes, I know you're going to ask. I do really quite enjoy the Marvel films. Um, I need to find a, a reference. Ugh. Ugh, that's what I'm saying. Right, I might have to finish this episode early because I'm just going back and forth and back and forth. There's only a couple of minutes left, so maybe we, maybe there's something that I've missed. Maybe there's an easel... Voucher. What was the voucher again? It was a Russian privatization voucher. Yeah, that doesn't really help. Um, can we ask Nico? Nico? Shh. I'm eavesdropping, Josh. Yes, we know you're eavesdropping. Right. Is there... I'm just going to stand back here. Is there a book that stands out on any of these shelves... As like being bright or something. I mean, there's this one here, but it just says bookcase. Any other, oh, well that's just says bookcase again. Any on the top here? Hmm. Right. Let me see if I can call. 
anyone. Vera security had dis. No. And finally, that. This place. I didn't need. No. Hmm. Maybe we can use a, a, a toilet. That maybe will show up that some kind of. That wasn't worth trying. Fingerprints? Nope. Fire. Is there anything in the cabinet? Anything but Oski had left the cabinet open. On the shelf inside. Yeah, we know. We know that. Can we turn the page? Everything was in 18... 1869. It was a thank you note from a... Huh. I suspected the medals weren't for... Um. It was Hobbes' business. Okay, so we've got a date of 1869. We need to... We need to... Trans, transcribe this somehow. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Hmm. Maybe... Maybe we... Set it on fire. I needed a. <laughs> I mean, I'm reaching now. Let's face it, I'm reaching. Let's put the cockroach. That out. was. Um. Yeah, I'm, I'm really. No, cut it. Nope. I needed to try something. Else. Hmm. A Russian imperial egg. That's so weird. Russian imperial egg. 1869. Note from a politician. Medals. Oh, God, I am think I'm going to have to leave it there, guys, and drop me a comment to nudge me along the right way. Don't tell me exactly, but, yeah, give me a hint, because I'm a bit stuck. Um, yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you have enjoyed me bumble around today. Till next time, have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening, whatever it is you're doing right now. Take care.